On the 12th of March 2019, the UAE's regulator, the General Civil Aviation Authority, issued a safety decision meaning that the Boeing 737 MAX aircraft could not fly in the UAE airspace. Our fleet of 11 Boeing 737 MAX 8 and 3 MAX 9 aircraft were immediately removed from operational service. While our fleet of 14 MAX aircraft have been grounded, they have been meticulously preserved and under continuous maintenance as part of an aircraft storage program. We employed a systematic approach to identify actions which could be taken over and above the minimum mandatory requirements to ensure that they will be returned to service in the best possible condition. The path to returning the aircraft to safe operational passenger service has been the role of regulators, led by the US Federal Aviation Administration, along with other regulators including the UAE's GCAA. They conducted an exhaustive 20-month review involving engineers, scientists, researchers, mechanics and pilots, and there have been a series of enhancements to the aircraft, its systems and pilot training. The conclusion and subsequent actions of this review has led to the approval of the aircraft to return to service by the US FAA, Europe's EASA and the UAE's GCAA, along with other regulators from around the world. Enhancements and modifications to the aircraft and pilot training are required prior to the return of the aircraft to passenger service. There have been software enhancements and additional protections to MCAS, the Maneuvering Characteristics Augmentation System. Other software updates not related to flight control system have been made, as part of continuous efforts to enhance flight safety. While on the ground, a wire separation modification was completed, every aircraft was thoroughly inspected for debris. Pilot training has been enhanced and includes both classroom and full motion simulator training. These changes and enhancements have been validated and form part of our regulator's approval to return the aircraft to service. Prior to resuming service, we will comply with all of the GCAA's stringent requirements. These will be implemented to the highest international standards by our professional teams. When each aircraft was stored, it went through a process designed to preserve the aircraft, its engines and systems while not in use. This process will now be reversed and each aircraft will be thoroughly inspected against criteria defined by the GCAA. After receiving additional training, our experienced in-house maintenance and engineering teams will ensure that every aircraft receives the prescribed inspections, checks, enhancements and modifications before it returns to service. Every one of our pilots will receive additional training before they fly the MAX. This training program exceeds the regulatory requirement. It will be conducted in the classroom and in Fly Dubai's MAX aircraft full motion simulator here in Dubai. An operational readiness flight will be completed before the GCAA approves each and every aircraft for passenger service. We can be confident in the thorough work undertaken by our regulator and the unwavering professionalism of our maintenance, training, and flight operations team in safely returning the aircraft to service. The MAX is ready to fly Dubai.